We assume this is Zoo. It's Full Mulligan here. The Sloth! Thanks for the sub. Welcome, welcome to the Dragon Army. Hello. Okay, so he is... He is... Even walk. We got a donation from Heckio. It's a day off to catch Tibler's stream is my favorite day off. Well, glad you enjoy it. Thanks for being here. Okay. Ooh, there's the subject. I think with subject nine in my hand, I want to get this out of my hand because this is going to draw five cards. Uh, Casper, welcome to the Dragon Army. There's a Rexar. I do not want to get a Huffer here. Oh well. I will just flanking strike this. I want to, like, the coin is really valuable with Rexar and Subject 9 to actually sequence out, like, multiple secrets or, like, getting Rexar plus uh, activation. Yon Aguila. Thanks for the sub. Welcome, welcome to Dragon Army. Mountain Giant. Alright, well, here we go. I'm gonna burn a card here, unless I coin. I think coin is more valuable than drawing a card here, because I can play trap into spellstone or something similar. Just Rexar here and kill this. It's kind of medium. I could kill command this, attack here. Yeah. I think we attack with the one ones. And then I think we want to play Venom Strike. And Wandering. Uh, do I want explosive? I think we actually want explosive. Because that means that we can potentially Rexar the next turn if he just stacks face. Because this guy can't attack this, right? So if he attacks here and gets exploded, both these guys die now. Well, I guess this guy doesn't die straight up, but. Are you going to defile it or something? Okay. Now we can just like Hellfire and uh, play a 7-7. Seven, seven. Okay. We have Rexar here, but it doesn't really do very much at the moment. Like I don't have enough damage to actually get through and kill my opponent before we could potentially actually use the Rexar. Or potentially like you know win with the, the hero power. I think I'm just gonna Rexar. Pretty bad for me. It's gonna be a six cost to poison this fresh guy. Yeah, this is not good. I can get like Wind Fury on this with the Rage of Maw, could potentially kill both these big guys. Oh. Well, I'm dead. 
That Shadow Flame was pretty gross. Okay, so we need like a Poison Split Bat, basically. Poisonous? Wandering is the best of these to prevent some damage to myself. This into like anything but a Misha is pretty relevant. It's actually pretty good that he attacked with this, because I want to be able to spellbreaker and attack into this guy. Ooh, Blade Master too. Wow. Okay, maybe I'm not dead. Interesting. I mean if our opponent finds Gul'dan, we're almost certainly going to be dead, but we do have Rexar. We found a medic to save our lives. Still like defile here. One, two, three. Leave this at two health. Again, spellstone. If we get life steal rush, I think we just still want the hatchling. Defile me here or hellfire me. We know one of the cards is Twilight Drake from the uh, deer. Okay. That's ugly. I mean, it's not that bad necessarily. That's a useless draw. That's pretty useless. Do we just want to taunt here? We can silence this. Play this. If he hellfires, this kills Lich King. It's a very, very pissed off chicken. Okay, that means no Gul'dan at least. Still has a hellfire, a spellstone, a silence. Uh, here comes the upgraded spellstone. Uh, no, okay. Death coil. Ew. Okay. Hitting in the face sounds dangerous. Seems like the sort of thing that gets you killed. There you go. Well, I am never gonna get a good beast. Gotten a zero life steal rush. I've gotten zero rush. Every single beast has just been like an onboard. Okay, you're gonna do this. You're gonna do this. <laughs> okay, so he's gonna defile or hellfire here. Dread infernal. Uh, okay, that's actually much worse for me. Into dooms there. Okay, so he's goldoning next turn, pretty much for sure. I've drawn all of my secrets already, so this is not very good. It's like a loose specimen. This with lifesteal rush is like ins is kind of insane. Thank you. We'll kill his doomsayer. All right, that worked out pretty well. If he Gul'dans, he's getting back one hooked reaver, two vulgar homunculus. He didn't trade this in first. Like, if he wanted to trade this in, he should have traded in, he just would have gotten a 6-6. Six, six. Okay, he just wants to go face. That's pretty dangerous against this. God, I still have two Mossy Horrors in my deck against this board. Okay. Tundra Rhino, you're up. I want the Poisonous one, I think. This gives me taunt, but that doesn't really matter too much. Poisonous taunt, yeah. We're taking this. I think I attack this so he can't Hellfire. I guess he could always just like, attack there, ping. But he can't like Hellfire and keep this. Yeah, we're gonna attack here. This is kind of a useless card, so we're just gonna play it anyway. But we don't want him to be able to Hellfire and keep this alive, is the whole goal of attacking that into there. Otherwise he could Hellfire eat this, 
and then trade this into here, and we don't want that. So now he just has to trade this if he's doing it. Spellbreaker, okay. That's fine. I mean, I'm, I'm at 29 now after this. Okay. This guy lived, too. So we get to actually play both of these and trade it. And now, ooh, Cave Hydra is great. With Life Still Rush. That's pretty perfect. Oh god, yes. I'm gonna Razor Maw it now, so I can potentially give it stealth. I mostly want uh, increased health, because it can still die to Hellfire. Eh, oh well. I'll just Wind Fury. Well, he's gonna kill it. We'll save this. There's really no reason to play it, because he's almost certainly gonna Hellfire. If he doesn't have Hellfire, great. Then, like, these live too. Yep, there's the Hellfire. Skulking Geist? Okay. So, build ourselves a beast. It's like a life drinker. We want this. Yeah, we can get, like, potentially, like, stealth on this guy or something. There's stealth on that guy. Can't be targeted is very good against the hero power. He's just gonna, he can just shoot this guy, but I think that's fine. Like, I'm just gonna be building beasts trying to beat his, his cards, so. These don't really do anything here. He doesn't have enough cards to play three in a turn, I don't think. Explosives meaning meaningless at this stage. So we're just gonna fatigue him. We also have another Spellstone left, so these could, like, upgrade our Spellstone, and he's out of Hellfires. Wouldn't I rather play a secret and make him play around it? Well, this way he doesn't get to siphon life my face for a turn. I think that's more important. Alright, well, this is almost certainly just going to attack into this, depending on what I get. There's a Spellstone. I'm actually just going to full Spellstone here and trade into this. Because now his Hellfires are gone. He can't set up a Defile path here. There's no way for him to easily get a 1, right? Okay. He's got to play defense. You can't really play defense when you're fatiguing in a card. Explosive into Godfried. If he has Godfried in his deck, I'd be really impressed because he's even more luck. He has a Twilight Drake that got bounced a million turns ago. There's a bow. Well, let's see what we can, can find here. Amalgam's just the best stats overall. Runt, though, we can potentially play alongside like a flanking strike this turn. I'm gonna take Runt. Ooh, Runt Boar. Nice. Let's see what we get. We also can maybe just... No, we can't really kill him. Wind Fury. We have 9, 10, 11... Oh, no, it doesn't have... It does have charge. So 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We just go face. We can also just clear his guys. Eh. Smork. an explosive trap up too, so. Are you killing the one that doesn't have Wind Fury? Oh, okay, there's a spell still. actually kind of annoying. Let's take this guy because we can play it alongside flanking. Probably should have just killed his guys rather than smorked. <laughs> it's a lot safer. <laughs> this with any three. I think actually just has another Spellbreaker and I'm dead, though. I feel like I must have screwed this up the turn that I smarked him. 
Because this guy just should be dead. I wanted the smart because it was like, you know, the hunter way, but... Yeah, his last card's a second to file. Get him. It's funny that the two patriarchs that got shuffled into my deck may very well be what make the difference between me getting fatigue killed and not. I think it's correct for him to actually ping my face there, right? Uh, we want this one so we can play this too. a <laughs> very long game. I feel like the, the turn that I smirked, I definitely should not have just smirked, but I was getting excited about the potential of smirking, because, you know, I'm playing Hunter. <laughs>